The starting pitcher for France is Charlene Gardner. And first betting for Italy is number 12 shortstop Amanda Rama. Diana, what kind of game are we going to see? Um, yeah, it's going to be, like you said, oh, wow. Deep fly ball to center field. Amanda Fama crossing the bases and gets stopped at third. A stand-up triple leading off the match here. He was starting off this game with a stand-up triple. We were talking, we were just starting talking about the game. She already hit that triple over the head of the center fielder. On the first pitch. For a minute I thought it was going out of the ballpark, but it just stayed in, it hit the fence. Line drive to opposite field. Elise Tribole, Eloise Tribole swinging at the first pitch and gets on the first base, a base hit for her. That's a very nice throw by catcher Cachetti because Eloisa Tibule is a very fast runner. Second half of the third inning here in Nedeli Glove. Betting for France. It's a high up into the mm -hmm. left foot. That's a real nice catch by Amanda Fama. Ball drops right there for base hit for Elisa Sayon. And gets the swing on the first pitch. Gets a touch off the pitcher. Gets a touch on the glove. Another swing on the first pitch and a base hit through the middle for Emily Carosone. Nice. That's ball to the catcher, lets it go, and... That's good base Another running. Chance. Good base running by uh, Laura Vigna. Three balls. He's definitely going to look for the perfect pitch, but now it's a walk. Counting one there and is. one, and there is the base hit with an RBI. There's the, the nice throw. throw. And she got her at home plate. Oh, oh. That was a really nice throw from the left fielder. Going to Fantastic the dump. catcher. Italian coach said, wait a minute, isn't she safe? We got the pitchers doubting, or the umpires doubting there. But she got around it and trying to avoid the tag. Now, well, it's very close. You can see her hand is going. And no, he still says he's out. Swings at that pitch, gets it through, and scoring two runs, two RBIs for her. And that is a, that is a big hit for Alessandra Rotondo. Yes, that's what you were talking about. The wild pitch gets Rotondo home for run number four for Italy in this inning and in this game as well. And there's the strikeout. Strikeout. So you can choose the pitch that you want. That ball grounds. Yes, it's a base hit for Fabrizia Marone. Oh, that's a really nice line drive hit into center field by Laura Minha. I think she's giving herself a little bit more time at the plate. Ball popping up and gets caught by first baseman Terry Pitcher. Three balls, one strike. She can go for the perfect pitch. Good move into center field. 
Nothing wrong with that one. Switching first base. And it was a nice base hit. That's the end that you want to see. As a coach, that's so satisfying. Yeah, and then she goes again. Whoa. Almost recovered by shortstop. And it is still a good hit. Gotta wait a little longer and hit the ball. Opposite field. And Norma Marie here with the base hit gets on first she, base. She finds the hole in right field. Now going for that same and she does there a base hit through the middle with Amanda Fama we saw her already with this big hit into center field but a high pitch there pop up a couple of times and now she's going to walk and here's the double steal Smart play there by Italy, and the ball goes up in the sky mm, to will do center it. field. That will do it. And that's going to be a sacrifice fly because Fabrizia Marone oh, scores oh, another run for Italy. So now you see oh, how important that steal was. I think good choice by Luis Tripoli, center fielder, not throwing the ball to home plate, but making the choice to try to get the runner. Number two. And there's the swing into and right, right field. at the right fielder. And Fama didn't have a chance to attack. Trying to get on base any way you can. She's starting as a sprinter in athletics. You can see it over there. Good running technique. And Rounder to third base, throw is in time. And the base and hit. Nice hit. Natalie Glover. Absolutely. Here's how the cast point from second base. Big fourth inning. How did you experience it on the field and uh, at bat? Uh, I was just thinking about hit hard and try to make my teammate score. That's it. Well, very good, and you did fantastic. Keeping the Olymp Olympic dream alive because you're moving on to the next round. How does it feel? We are ready to, to battle every game. We are ready to, to play every game, and I love my team. I'm proud of them, and I love it. I'm going to start with you, Rainer. How uh, how is how does it feel? Because it has to be a hard time right now, knowing that the Olympic dream for 2020 is kind of shattered. Yeah, but we are really happy because we did a, a great game uh, against Italy. It was all, it's always tough, and uh, I think that uh, our pitcher did a great game, and uh, us too. We uh, managed to uh, score, and it's the first time for a while that we didn't do that. So we are we lost. Okay, we will not go to uh, the Olympic Games, but we are happy because we, did a, we finished the competition with a great game. Eloise, I was just talking about that fourth inning, big fourth inning with a lot of runs against. How did you experience it in the field? What does that do with the, with the, with the mentality in the game? Uh, um, you know, it's, so, it's always tough to have people scoring on you when you're doing that good in the game, but I mean, it's, it's softball. Like, you're expecting them, Italy is a great team, you're expecting them to come back at that point, so you just want to keep fighting and uh, try for them not to score as many runs, and then you know you have the opportunity to score some, so that's all, that's all you can do. Uh, well, yeah, one last question for you. Uh, was this your last tournament? Uh, yeah, it was a lot of fun. I didn't tell them, so I, I want to, to tell them, yeah, it was uh, my last, but the, one of the best. Uh, best year I, I did as a player, as a teammate, so yeah, but I will be there as a coach. You never know, though. You never know, right? <laughs> <laughs> She's going to try to convince you, that's for sure. <laughs>
Thank you very much, girls, and uh, good luck in the future with the French softball.